We have seen certain reports about sex tourism in the Gambia, and it is becoming widespread. Prostitution in the Gambia is illegal. Most of the estimated individuals in the act are few Gambians and more other nationalities from West Africa. Prostitution takes place on the beach, in bars, and hotels on the coast. Away from the coast, prostitution mainly takes place in bars. The bars are frequently raided and the foreign prostitutes deported back to their home countries. They often return within a few days. Our team went out to have a discussion to hear from them why they engage into prostitution. All of them were not willing to talk, but after some conversations we were able to have one individual who was ready to talk with us and here is the full conversation i'm from nigeria so now uh, when it comes to the sexual work in gambia how do you see that as a woman and as somebody who sometimes venture into that how do you see it? Huh? It's only that one is not easy mm. as a woman because when woman if you don't work hard you can't get money now it's like like me for example like me mm. when i go out i used to make massage okay i used to make massage out sometimes now we go there when we have already agreed that okay this you will pay me 800 when you reach there, you will not say that I will not pay you the 800. Mm. But you will ask for another thing again. Okay. Well, it's because of the name of the money, mm. you must accept okay. to get the money from there. That is why I know. So are, they, are those men Gambians or what? Yeah. The Gambian men, they are so hard. Mm? Yeah. It's not all. Okay. Some of them. Mm -hmm. Some of them, they like to cheat. Okay. And some of them, they will tell you the truth. Mm. I, I have this. But when they know. come on with, with you, when they come with you like that, they say, ah, babe, I, I have this now. Can I drop? But some, they will come, they will say, that I have this, I have that, I have this. Mm. And it's a lie. Okay. They will not give you anything. They will let. They want to come and cheat on you. Yeah. After then, they yeah. will say that um, you know what, babe. Mm -hmm. um, uh, tomorrow I will send the money to your account. When you allow him to go like that, it's finished. It's finished. And uh, in most cases, uh, it is after you guys uh, have the massage and then do the extra work, then they will just leave you there. Yes. When then after massaging, mm -hmm. you make the extra work, work. finish. Mm -hmm. What they will just tell you that they will say that, hey, you know what, my mobile is off now. You know, to, I have to do the money transfer. To, to do the money transfer. Uh, you know what, I will call you tomorrow morning. I will send money for you. Mm -hmm. But when you start to be dragging with them, the, the best thing that was that was just tight to fight. Wow. They will just take you like they say, what do you want to do? I don't have any money now. I told you, go, 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 go. Mm -hmm. you, you are a stranger in my country. So that you go away. And that's in the way they are doing so. They can't do it, in, they can't do it for Gambia girl here. Any Gambia guys they invited to go to their house or to do work for them, before anything, before Gambia gets start anything with them, we first collect their money. You say, if you don't give me money, I will not give you anything. They will charge before anything. Wow. You see? But when we are, we are in a citizen here, they will say that you, you are a foreigner. 
Even though prostitution itself is illegal, women who are prostituting can still be victims of crimes. After a lengthy discussion with her, she was able to tell us that she had been threatened with a weapon. Okay. Sometimes they will just say that they, are, we are, they will give you 200. When they use you, some like this, they will go and take tablets. They will use you like machine. After then, they will say that they have this $200 in. Ah, so you, you, you yourself will be imagine that. We are not talking about $200. Why? Why do you give me $200 in? Before you know, some can remove the knife. Huh? Yeah. So they will, they, 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 they use that to you? Yes. They will just remove the knife. Please go away. And then I'll you just, have to leave. Uh, just because you are a foreigner. That is always they are used to speak. There are girls that will not touch their clothes because they know that there are girls immediately you reach there. Mm -hmm. They have to pay. You have to pay before anything. Mm -hmm. But because of we are a foreigner, we are a foreigner. Okay. They used to use us anyhow. There are several reasons why married men have affairs. In this situation, the lady that we spoke to told us that most of her customers are Gambian married men. A lot of people they like to cheat, so they are the married men. All these marriage people, mm -hmm. they like to cheat. Boys, you know that I don't have. If you don't have, you will not come and meet you. Okay. But you see the marriage men, so they will say that you are my girlfriend. Mm -hmm. I want to take you as my side chick. Side chick, you can't feed him. Side chick, you can't buy him food store. Okay, he's your side chick, bar. You want to sex him from flesh to flesh. Mm -hmm. And when you are going, you will be giving him two hundred dollars. Is it your wife? It's not your wife at home. Mm -hmm. Why can't you please him? Because you don't know the day you will come again. Sure. So he said that okay. You know what? I have three hundred, three hundred here now. Let me go inside my car. Then we bring car come. Wow. That is the reason I said that men in the Gambia, mm -hmm. especially marriage men, mm -hmm. they like cheating. Wow. All of those you have have connections with or have done something with. Are they only Gambians or you also have other nationalities who also come for massage and then ask for the extra? No. It's not only in Gambia I used to massage. Okay. I used to massage Surya alone and Senegalese. So how do you massage them? Where and where? Hmm. You massage <laughs> when I massage you know yeah. the what I used to like uh sorry alone people. Mm -hmm. When you want to massage them, yeah. you will first ask, you, say, you ask him, can I ask question? I mm -hmm. say you can ask. Say, ah, maybe if my body move, can you assist me? Okay. If I tell him that I can assist you, mm -hmm. you will say, I will, you say, okay, no problem. I will pay you extra. Okay, so how, how much is that extra? That how extra, much is the massage? How massage, much is the massage? my massage is 800. 800, so how much is extra? The extra is 500, it depends the way it's the uh, time. minutes, okay. the time you can make it. You know, For some yourself. men like this, you can just near a woman now. Five minutes, he drop. Wow. I used to massage some men like this. Immediately, the way I'm massaging him like this, before I know, he drop. Eh. So that I used to take condom, follow, but I would just say, please, yeah. can, I, can I do this for you? If you say that uh, I'm strong, okay. I'm not that kind of man, I will, I will cut. Okay. But I know this. He's like that. Uh, he's a one Senegalese. Mm -hmm. I massage him immediately. I just be just be pressing only body. I'm never going down. Hmm? Before I know, wow. he drop all in me. He say, "Please, I'm sorry." I say, "Hey, say that, oh, please. I'm sorry." He's in my mind a long time. I say, "When is he? this thing? Is your mind all right? But you can invite your girlfriend." So this this massage center you are telling me about is it? yours or where is it located is it at your house or you have a place where you do this massage oh, and they used to invite me ah uh, okay okay now i they, I they have, used to invite you yes to go over. yes because i have contacts okay i used to give some people my contact when i go to beach okay when you're doing this massage what do you wear because 
It is so frustrating, like men will be demanding for you to go over and massage them. So, what do you wear? Do you go all naked or do you just have your bra and on this? How, how do you go about that? No, 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 no. Or you just wear African? I we just wear normal my clothes the way I'm just used normal. to wear. Yeah. Okay. The way I used to wear my clothes, I, I wear it. I don't used to wear bone short, I don't wear singlet. Okay. Just in normal clothes I wear. But we mean maybe I reach there. What's the I magic take, you have? I take my oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Be starting my job. Mm -hmm. Maybe the way I'm doing it, mm -hmm. it be feeling from I will just tell him please hold on. Mm -hmm. Let me finish my job. Okay. After I finish my job, anything you want from me. Okay. You can guess and go. You ahead. can tell me. All right. That's all. You are naughty. <laughs> it's so interesting like to have her to tell us about her experience in the Gambia. So now, uh, let me ask you like if someone do not want to be massaged because some guys might want to go straight into the act. So in such situations, how do you chat them? Okay, if someone just come direct, direct that no ah, massage. He's not massaging yeah. ah Kadi. Mm. I just need you to catch him form, mm -hmm. I will just tell him that, hey, my job is like this. Mm -hmm. If you make one round, it's 500. Mm -hmm. If you make two round, it's 1,000. If you want to pass night in my house, mm -hmm. you'll pay me 2,000. Because I know that when you pass through mm -hmm. in my house, yeah. my house is not hotel. Because when we go to hotel, you will pay money. And you pay me. So that if you know that you want to pass night in my house or we go out to pay me 2000 how are you able to hide what you do oh, i used to hide it why uh, because it's not it's not the job you are can you can be proud in for it like my massage now i can proud for it yeah because i can open shop they will see that this shop they are massaging in this shop you understand, but sexing all over, mm -hmm. you can't proud of for it all right. because they will tell they will tell you that you are a cheat. Why do you think like you really have to do this? Did you just wake up one day and say, ah, today I have to do this job? What led you into into this? What led you? Oh, uh, actually. What, uh, this one you ask now, it's not a part of what we are talking about before, mm. but I will cut it short. Yeah. Actually, I mean, I'm a hairdresser. I'm a fashion, making up, fixing nails, all this. That is my own job, okay. natural. But when everything changed, and I look like I can't stay forever like this. And I know about the massaging in my grandmother hand so that I said okay so far that I know about this let me use this to be looking for money that is all okay. all right it's very interesting and um, like you said you have magic in your hands and then you're making a good use of it which were you married before yes you have children yes okay so it is this money you used to take care of them Yes. Well, are they in Gambia with you? Or? No, they are in Nigeria. They are in Nigeria. Okay. So you said it is because of situations that is why you get into the business. Yeah. Um, but, which is something I really appreciate you telling. And uh, do you think like one day you will be able to change and say, I'm not going to do this anymore? Yes. I know that it's not forever. Okay. When I get, when I get what I need. Okay. I will leave this job. What exactly I, do you need? I need money. Money. So start a better business and sit there okay. to look for my children. All right. So have you spoken to a few people, either your Gambian friends, your Nigerian friends, or your neighbors? Have you looked for help from somebody? I, no. Why? <laughs> But I've already seen the way my neighbor be. 
Your my family. My, my now, now, let's forget about the neighbor. Okay. Now, let's say family. Because that comes You first. know, family by itself have your own situation, your own problem by itself. Each, each person have your own problem. Okay, I come and meet you today. Please, access me. I need this, I need that. You say that, hey, tomorrow you come. Next tomorrow you come. Now you are calling in phone. You put your, you put it in a okay. fly mood. Okay, you will call him again, or you will go there again. You can't. Okay. Okay. For example, when I enter this Gambia now, I have one cousin in, in this Gambia. When I enter, I I want to rent house. I tell him that I have eight hundred dollars in my hand, and the house I want to rent is ten thousand. Only one room, each one room. No toilet inside, though. no kitchen inside. Only one room. They told me that it's 10,000. Okay, I call my brother. Tell him that, hey, bros, it's like this, it's like this, it's like this. Please, raise me up. Even though if you, don't, if you cannot touch me, borrow me, when I be okay, I will, I will return it for you. Hey. When he... Send out the story down. I'm scared. I can't say anything again. Because what is told me, eh, you know that I have two wives. Uh, my children is there. This and this, this and okay, let me look the way it will be. Maybe I will call you back tomorrow. Maybe you can call me this night, I don't know. Okay. So that I can I try to get myself mm -hmm. to help myself. Okay. That is it. Alright. So do you do you do you um, ever have a client that promised you like after you doing the, the thing with him and he's like I promise you I can change your life and never because you explained something like that now let's get in a, a situation wherein maybe it was a matter of life and death you explained about the knife so are there other stories which really scares you? Like when you're doing this kind of thing with, no. with strangers? Mm -mm. No. Never. I just take my cross my, by myself. Mm -hmm. Because I've already tried one mm -hmm. before. It's not possible. Okay. So that I don't need it to be. Who will help you? It will help you. Okay. Anywhere you, you are, your helper it will come and cross you. Okay. That is what I believe. You see, that is the reason I used to assist myself okay. by now. Maybe when God answer my prayer, mm -hmm. I can be what I want to be. Okay. And I will get my dream. That is all. What is your dream? Uh, I'm taking my dream every day, every day. I want to be a this. Okay. I want to be this. I want to be that. Okay. But I know that inshallah, mm. God will answer my prayer one day. Okay. All right, thank you very much for having okay, you. Okay, you are welcome. <laughs> so what else do you want to add to the program so that, you know, people can... Okay, what do you yeah. want me to add with your program so that people will admire? <laughs> well, uh, just tell us, like, <laughs> how to do them. Because somebody is saying, oh, my God, I need massage. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Hey, so so is, there, is there a secret to your massage? And uh, apart from that, because... Uh, you do massage and then men are just going vrrr with it with it so <laughs> so uh do you ever think of like when your dream came true or when, when your dream comes true do you think of opening a massage center hmm. you know i can think about that mm -hmm. but we train someone okay okay you know sometimes you will train somebody yes someone. okay i will train but she wouldn't do extra. Mm -mm. Okay. okay. Maybe uh, I open in the shop. Mm -hmm. I have like two girls okay. there. Okay. They will be working for me for there. Right. You know that they can make such of things in there. Okay. Except maybe I let the contact back. So they later okay. we see that's all. all right. But so in that in that place, mm -hmm. I know that they can do the extra. All right. So what, what, okay, one thing um, I want to ask, how many men can you go with for a night? 
That is what I forgot. If like I'm basing with the job, mm -hmm. but I'm not basing with the job. Okay. But how many men can you go with for a night? Huh? If like uh, is a if it's not a, a flesh to flesh, if like we are using condom. Okay. That is circle. If you are using that, mm -hmm. I can I be I, I can take like five or six. Six men. Yeah. If you are using condom. Yes. So if they are not using condom. If they are not using condom, it's only one. It's only one. Yes. All right. So now, um, do have you ever thought of like, oh my God, I don't know this person. How can I go skin to skin with this person? He's only my because best friend. I can do skin to skin with. Ah. That is the reason. Yeah. Okay. He's only my boyfriend. Okay. I can do skin to skin like this. No. Okay. I because he has a lot of sickness. Yeah. So your boyfriend knows you're doing this kind of job? But you are a woman, you can't tell your your boyfriend that I'm doing this now. Ah. You know that I, <laughs> you know the, what the, I know that you know mm -hmm. that you know that I used to go and massage. Okay. Okay. You used for that. All but right. sometimes I when I'm going you say that, hey madam, be careful. Okay, with the massage. Because the last time when I came, mm -hmm. I said that I, I see something funny to me today. He said, what? I said, hey, he's mad like you. Mm -hmm. When I, I just enter like this, I press like this, press like this. Before I put an for in waste, he said, ah, I said, yes. He <laughs> said, that one is not a man. He's Whoa. a woman. Wow. I said, I said that, 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 that one is not because I'm, okay. but I go let my money. Mm -hmm. I said, are you sure that he don't touch you? Mm -hmm. I said, come and test it. Maybe. Maybe it tastes, or it touched me, or it's not touched me. Okay. That is it. All right. Okay, that's great. And uh, so happy having you uh, today. And uh, it was such a big pleasure for us to, you know, have this talk with you. The government of the Gambia should work towards bringing in strict enforcement of law to see that no one should dare enter into such activities. You have heard what the lady has said about her own story and everything that happens in the sex industry. From me, our gay, and my entire team, Jollof Entertainment, thank you so very much for viewing.